This is not Jim Cantori, not reporting for the Weather Channel. This is Mad Mike hanging out with you at South Shore Beach in Little Compton as Hurricane Dorian quickly moves up the East Coast at one mile an hour. Maybe slowly moves up the East Coast at one mile an hour. I thought I'd come by the local beach here and see if everyone is preparing for the aftermath and the strike of Hurricane Dorian. So we're going to talk to some people, check out the surf, and see who's getting ready for Hurricane Dorian. All right, I am here with... Christina. Christina. <laughs> Christina, are you worried about Hurricane Dorian? No. Christina is not worried about <laughs> Hurricane Dorian. Have you done anything to prepare for Hurricane Dorian? No. <laughs> no extra I'm here bread? at the beach. <laughs> She's here at the beach, relaxing, reading about... What are you reading? The Proposal. The Proposal. Oh, you got to hold it up to the... The proposal. <laughs> yes. It's Who, pretty good. It is? Yeah. It, who, it's a light read for the beach. A light read for the beach. So yeah. so obviously no worries about Hurricane Dorian? Not at all. Not at all. No, no no extra bread or milk or not here, maybe in Florida. Maybe in Florida. All right, Christina, thank you very much. Right, We're talking to some more folks here at South Shore Beach in Little Compton <coughs> about Hurricane Dorian. I am with Steve. Steve and Chrissy. Chrissy. Stephen Chrissy, what do you think about the hurricane? Well, it's a scary thing, unless you're at South Shore Beach in Little Compton, then it's not quite as scary. True. Not scary at all. So what brings you to the beach today? The sun. The sun, which they don't have in Florida. Sorry. But have you done any preparation for the hurricane at all? Uh, we bought beer. <laughs> they bought beer! I bought wine. They bought beer. Well played, well played. So what, what, you, what, what, what is your craziest hurricane memory? I windsurfed Hurricane Gloria the morning that it hit Aquidneck Island. Off Aquidneck Island, you yep. windsurfed during Hurricane Gloria? On Easton's Beach, yes. On Easton's Beach, or yep. First Beach as we call it First around here. First Beach, correct. Awesome. Yep. So you're just enjoying the sun today, relaxing, no worries about Hurricane Dorian? On vacation. On vacation. Well, my daughter lives in Florida, so that's a bit of a concern, but she's on the Gulf side, and I don't think it's really going to get affected. So it's not going to the Gulf side at all. Yeah. All right, well, thank you very much. Sir, for You're very welcome. Nice to meet you. N nice meeting you as well. Enjoy. And the d here's the dog. Yes, he's not worried about Hurricane Dorian. worried about Hurricane Dorian. All right, I have stopped by to talk to you. You are? Melissa Belair. Melissa Belair and? Sarah. And Sarah, relaxing here at the beach. What book are you reading, Melissa? Uh, window by, on the Bay by Win Debbie, Debbie Maycomber. Window on the Bay. So it seems like you're very comfortable here. Are you worried at all about Hurricane Dorian? No. No. Have you done any preparation or? No. No. Do you plan on going out getting bread and milk and stocking up? And no. No. Do, do, do you care about Hurricane Dorian? Yeah. But I don't think it's going to reach here. No, I don't think it's going to reach here either. What was, what was, have you been through a lot of hurricanes here in New England? I haven't been through any. Really? Have you lived here like? Well, I lived north of Boston. Oh, north of Boston. I have been, been through a few. Have you been through any hurricanes before? I don't think so. The only big thing that I've been through is the blizzard of 78. The blizzard of 78, New Englanders will never, ever, ever forget. Yeah, I know that one. <laughs> All right, that's it. Thank you very much, ladies. Enjoy your day at the beach. Wave to the kid. Your name? Mia. Mia. Brady. Brady. Anthony. Anthony. So you guys have heard about the big hurricane down in, in Florida, right? Yes. Yeah. Do you know what the name of the hurricane is? Okay. It starts with a D. It starts with a D. Three. Close. So think of the, who is the cartoon explorer? Dora, so close, it's like Dora, but it's a boy's name. Dorian! That's right, that's right. Ha have you guys done anything to prepare for the hurricane? Oh, yeah. ha have you bought any extra food or milk or bread or anything? Oh, I'm with shopping. Yeah. You're with shopping? Yeah. What would she buy? Milk. Just the regular stuff. Just the regular stuff. So if you guys are lucky, you got the whole beach to yourself. Having fun today? All right. Hey, so what's the biggest the hurricane can get to? What number? Category five. Awesome job. Give me some high fives. All right. Thank you, guys. Enjoy the beach. Have fun. Hey, we're back live on South Shore Beach in Little Compton as we get ready for Hurricane Dorian 
to move up the coast. I am sitting with Ryan. Ryan and Marie. Marie. All right, have you two done any preparation for Hurricane Dorian? Yeah, we got lots of Tito's and uh, pulling springs. Lots of Tito's handmade vodka, right? Yes. 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 <laughs> gluten free. Not, not the tacos, but the gluten free handmade vodka. So you yeah. are well prepared. Yeah, very well prepared. Absolutely, we have done nothing. We've absolutely done nothing. Yep. Except for the vodka. Except for the vodka. If yeah. we could deal with snowstorms, we could deal with a Category 1 hurricane. So and you're probably the two most prepared people I've talked to all day so far. Nobody else has even no one's got even milk or bread. It, huh? At least you thought far enough to head to have the, the, the refreshing beverages. Ready. Is everybody. No, no offense to um, weathermen, but they generally don't know. Can I swear? <laughs> they don't know I, I, their behind. Beep. They don't know their ass from their elbow. Okay, we're gonna get ten different reviews, ten different reports, and every single one of them are gonna be wrong. Well, that sums up that. My job is done. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you, Marie. Marie. Woo. He's, like, he's like, I'll never interview this kid again. No, but, like, that, that's that. That. but that was the whole idea, just to have some fun, you know. That wraps up our interviews on South Shore Beach in Little Compton. As you can see, the surf is a treacherous one and a half feet. I, I guess that's treacherous. One and a half to two feet surf. Everybody's enjoying the day. And no one, absolutely no one in Rhode Island is worried about Hurricane Dory. Once again, this is not Jim Cantori, not reporting for the Weather Channel. It's Mad Mike hanging out with you. Be safe.